What's up everyone? In this video, we're going to learn how to switch our personal Instagram account to a professional business account. Why would we want to do this? Because the professional business account gives us access to tools that we do not have with our personal account. If we switch to a professional business account, we will be able to use the Instagram Graph API to have full control over all of the social media interactions with that account. When we switch to a professional business account, the first thing we gain access to is the Instagram insights are like Google Analytics for your Instagram account. Get a look into your audience, how many followers you're gaining weekly, the interactions you're having with them, their demographics such as age, location, gender, and a whole lot of other things. The other things that unlock when you switch to a professional business account are a call to action button, which you can add to your profile and a link button when you are creating a story. So if you create a story, you'll be able to add a link to your story. Lastly, you will be able to create ads on Instagram and promote different posts. So grab your phone and open up Instagram. Head over to your profile, click the hamburger menu and click settings. Under settings, click on the account and scroll to the bottom. There you will see a switch to professional account. Click on that and then click on business. We see it's telling us about some of the tools that it's going to allow us to access. You can learn more about your followers with the insights. Here's the contact button that we can add to our profile. Reach your customers by creating um, promotions and ads. Those are, the, those are the tools we're gonna get access to. So we're gonna hit continue and then we're gonna select our Facebook page. Now, if we're trying to use the Instagram Graph API, we do need to connect this to a page that we are the admin of. I'm gonna select my page and click next. Now it's asking us to review our contact information. This is the information that will show up if you wish to use it, but I'm gonna click don't use my contact info. And that's it, we're done. We have successfully converted our Instagram account to a professional business account. Now if we open up the hamburger menu up here, you see we have this insights tab right here. Click on that. This will take us to the Instagram insights where we can get an overview of our audience, location, age ranges, genders, followers, um, activity, and content. Head back to your profile and click the edit profile. At the bottom of the edit profile, you have uh, contact options. So if we click on this, these are the actions that you can select for your profile. And to add one of those to our profile, we would just select one, click next, and follow the steps. The other thing we're gonna look at is the promotions. Back on our profile, we're gonna click promotions. Here is where you can create a promotion. Click on create promotion. This is where you select which post you want to promote. I will select my the last video I created and click the next button. Then you get to select where you want to send the people when they click on it. I'm going to send them to my website. Click next. Audience. You can either set it up or set it to automatic. We will leave it on automatic and go to the next page. This is the budget and duration of your promotion. It will tell you how much you want to spend and the estimated reach. Last page is the review page. You're all set. It's going to give you an overview of what we've just selected. And if I actually wanted to promote this post, I would click create promotion. But I'm going to go back to my profile. The last thing we're going to look at is adding to your story. Click on add story, take a nice picture of yourself, and you will notice up here there is a link button now. And when you click on that, it gives you more options to how you can set the link and where it's going to direct the user when it says see more at the bottom of the story. And that's a quick breakdown of the tools that we gain access to when we switch from a personal account to a professional business account. That's going to do it for this video. In the last video, we learned how to switch our account to a creator account. In this one, we learned how to switch it to a business account. Now that we know how to switch our account to a professional account, either creator or business, we can now go ahead and start using the Instagram Graph API. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll catch you guys later.